This is Eric Moskowitz. Change is ahead for the Longfellow Bridge, the century-old landmark that connects Boston and Cambridge over the Charles River. Plans filed by the state with federal regulators and released to the public this week show the number of vehicle lanes shrinking from four to three to allow for wider and more inviting sidewalks and bike lanes. That's good news for anyone who has ever tried to cross what until now has been a daunting Longfellow Bridge on foot or by bike. But it doesn't have to be bad news for drivers. Engineers say the bridge can easily lose one of the outbound lanes without slowing traffic. Bottlenecks around the bridge tend to occur at Charles Circle on the Boston side, near MGH, and are not related to the capacity of the bridge itself. Though some advocates for walking and biking wanted even more dramatic changes, the plan is still considered a victory for green travel and shared public streets. The construction, likely to approach $300 million, is expected to begin next year and run to 2016. Eric Moskowitz for the Boston Globe.